Dr. Poor and other health professionals say by wearing a mask, I protect you, you protect me. Some say not COVID-19, but other medical reasons will keep them from following a mandate. We haven't heard one dang thing about taking vitamins or anything. You just want to mask us? What is this? Plenty of people line up without wearing masks, urging the Douglas County Board of Health to avoid a mandate. This is an insane like violation of our rights as citizens. This is a demonstration of government overreach to tell people they have to put something on their face that restricts breathing, that can cause migraines, that can cause breakouts, that can be a detriment to some people's health. Like this woman who shared personal information of a sexual assault that gave her post-traumatic stress disorder. If you don't understand what I'm talking about, thank your lucky stars that you have no idea what it would be like to be confined against your will and have a mask remind you of that. Anybody that has trouble breathing when they wear a mask, we don't want them wearing a mask. University of Nebraska Medical Center researcher Dr. John Lowe believes the mask mandate is overdue, saying we're at a point of uncontrolled community transmission. And he says people with breathing problems like COPD or severe asthma face a high risk of infection. He offers an alternative for those people, a clear face shield, if that's tolerable. There's emerging research that looks really promising around face shields that you know, kind of come around the face and cover more of the face, and they seem to provide uh, more protection. Health Director Dr. Adi Poor says Douglas County has a positivity rate of almost 10%, with dozens of cases a day, if not more. She wants to see that rate drop to 5% and says she's basing her decision for a mask mandate on the data. I'm not a politician. I'm not an elected individual. I'm a public health person responsible for the entire health of the state, of the Douglas County. Well, and Dr. Poor tells us she spent the weekend reading all the emails people sent her regarding the mask mandates, around 100. She said she even read the ones that personally attacked her. She says her decision is based on science and not on emotions. <laughs>